And welcome to Innovate Marketing Daily. Today is March 1st, 2023. My name is Sean P. Neal, and we are brought to you by MyPodcast.media. MyPodcast.media produces podcasts for brands and nonprofits. And today I welcome you to bring out your guitars, your drums, your saxophones, and rock on as we celebrate Matthias Huga Hamilton being awarded the Franchisee of the Year by the International Franchise Association. Let's get into it. So today, first off, I want to put to bed any rumors or curiosities you may have. Yes, I play a couple of musical instruments. Yes, I played those for a long time, many years of my life. Yes, that's actually what got me into a career in professional audio many, many moons ago. No, I will not be performing for you today. Why? Well, there's a reason I never pursued that as a career. So what does that have to do with today's show, right? You ask. Well, let's talk about it, because the International Franchise Association named Matthias Puga Hamilton, Master Franchisee of the School of Rock in Latin America, there's the connection, as a 2023 Franchisee of the Year. Uh, Matthias currently owns four schools in Latin America. So let's take a break and put a pen in this, come back, and we'll revisit that. But the School of Rock is uh, an organization that helps aspiring musicians master skills unleash creativity, and develop tools they need to thrive in life. It was founded as a single school in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania in 1998, and it's become a rapidly growing international franchise with over 500 schools open and in development across 15 global markets. So a lot of significant growth happening since uh, they originally opened. But listen to this. Since 2009, School of Rock has grown its student count from 4,000 to nearly 60,000. That is a lot of people going through this program. All right, then the International Franchise Association, by the way, celebrating over 60 years in existence. uh, It's the world's oldest and largest organization representing franchising worldwide. So that's where these two organizations come together. Now let's go back and revisit this award. The Franchisee of the Year Award is sponsored by IFA's partner, Paychex, and it recognizes leading franchise owners from IFA member brands whose outstanding performance and contributions help protect, enhance, and promote the franchise business model. So the way it works basically is an individual is nominated by the parent company. In this case, it would be School of Rock. And they're selected for their service to their communities, for fostering a strong and vibrant workforce, uh, for opening the doors for career growth and entrepreneurship, and supporting their fellow franchisees. So congratulations, Matthias, on being given this award. And then just to put into context how important the franchisee-franchisor relationship is, I want to give you a couple of statistics. So there are approximately 800,000 franchised businesses across the U.S., providing over 8.4 million direct jobs and generating over $800 billion in economic output. So to have that and to have a successful franchisee-franchisor relationship, I have learned that one of the most important pieces is to have that relationship secured from the beginning to have a good, positive relationship between the two. And so with that said, I was really impressed to go to schoolofrock.com and look at their franchising page and to recognize, and by the way, franchisors, pay attention here. This is a great, great thing that they are doing. They actually have a Franchising 101 uh, webinar where you can talk to experts uh, and they'll take you through the franchise world and answer questions about School of Rock and essentially help you if you're just considering, you know, maybe dabbling in the idea of what would it look like to be a franchisee, to own one of these. This is a really great way to start that relationship and to get some questions answered and to better understand what that would look like in the future. So hats off to them for for being uh, a franchisor who knows the, the importance of kicking that off the right way. And congratulations to Matthias. That's a a great honor, Matthias, Franchisee of the Year, awarded by the International Franchise Association. All right, my friends, that is it for today. My time is up. 
But as you know, I will be looking and listening for all of the greatest things happening in the world of marketing, branding, and business growth. And I will be back here tomorrow to share it with you. I probably won't have my guitar, but I'll be back here with you. I hope you'll join me. Until we meet again, stay safe, be well. See ya.